Until recently, most people wouldn't have known this house existed. The front was overgrown with trees and weeds, blocking its 175 years of existence. But now, one of Youngstown's oldest houses has been saved and is in the process of being put back into productive use. At the bend on Glenwood Avenue, next to Conroy's Party Shop, sits a house bought in June by the Youngstown Neighborhood Development Corporation for $25,000. It's not the oldest building in the city, but it, it's definitely one of the oldest. So we don't know exactly the year of construction, but we know the time period, 1840s, 1850s. Watch your step. There's a lot of right. level changes here. YNDC's Ian Beniston and Tiffany Sokol walked me through the inside, pointing out what was original. Well, we're standing on the original wood floors here, which we will try to preserve. And then um, as you look around, you can see a lot of original woodwork, um, you know, the structural beams. Obviously, these are hand-hewn beams that uh, originally were here when they built the property. The fireplace was also original, albeit well used. Yeah, frequently, very frequently, and, and probably not safely, so. <laughs> not everything, though, dates to the time of the original construction. So the house has gone through many owners. Um, there's been a lot of DIY projects done in that house, uh, certainly over the last 100 plus years. Outside, the foundation's original, and the wood siding appears to be two, though it will eventually be covered with vinyl. The house was built by John Oldhouse on what was then 96 acres. Now, 175 years later, there's a tentative plan on how to repurpose it. Our intention is to create some commercial space so we can kind of build off what we've been doing here and bring a little bit uh, more energy to this section of Glenwood. The plan is to have it ready to be occupied by this time next year. If the house was built in the 1840s, it would be the fourth oldest house in Youngstown. The oldest is at 3538 McGuffey Road on the east side, built in 1802. Also on the east side, on Atkinson Avenue, is a house built in 1807. And one on McCullum Road, the west side, that was built in 1813.